What do you do for a living? I work for NGOs. You are a homeless. No. <laughs> But besides your full-time job, do you have any side hustle? Yeah, I do e-commerce. Drop shipping. You are spending your parents' money for your friends? Family business. Diesel and manufacture aluminium. What do you do for a living? Right now, I'm an entrepreneur. <laughs> you are an entrepreneur? Yes. Wow, well done. What we were looking for. How much is it generating for you? Give us a range. Five or six figures? If you become a millionaire, yeah. what would you do with that money? Maybe travel, because I love to travel. Invest in houses, yes. I think I will travel the world. Car and give it to my family too. When you make a million dollars, the million dollars makes you. <laughs>
The million dollars makes you. I will become a better person. Maybe I'll, I'll be able to focus. And one of my motivations, this is another Ty Lopez thing. He talks about four motivations that people have. Health, wealth, love, my passions, and my happiness. I, I'm, I'm a simple guy. I have a few passions I like, music and, and rollerblading. And so just like fully grind in on those. And I guess take care of my family and my future family as well too. Nice advice. Thank you very much. Early your 20s, you already have this great mindset. And that's really great. Thank you very much for giving <laughs> us interview. Yeah, guys, you saw how amazing that guy gave advice in his early 20s. And he has already great mindset giving advice from Ty Lopez, what he learned from Grant Cardone. Let's go to interview other people because we have a lot of great Gen Z people, great mindset to hear from them. Let's go. Hello, your name, age, and where are you from? Uh, my name is Juliana. I'm 17 and I'm from Malta. What do you do for a living? I go to school mostly. Mostly, but the rest of the time? <laughs> to the beach or I work for my family business. You have family business work? Yes. Uh, what type of business is it? They sell and manufacture aluminum. And what do you do in that company? I do sales. Okay, you are good at selling. Selling stuff, yeah. Really? Yeah. Okay. And what is the secret of your selling skills? How you I, are selling more? I don't know. You just got to use your charm, I guess. Uh huh. There's really nothing special about it. But you have to have some skills for selling more, I guess. I mean, yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. it's clients mostly are Maltese. They appreciate that I'm Maltese, and we just like click like that, I guess. Ah. Okay. If we are not Maltese, we cannot work well there. No, no, no. Of course, you can work well, obviously. But the employees and everything. Mm -hmm. are Maltese and most of the clients are Maltese as well mm -hmm. so they appreciate that and being in your position how much money can we make per month I'd rather not say to be fair <laughs> okay no problem because this is your family business yeah. well do you have any side hustle or extra income yeah I help my brother with he does drop shipping oh, he does drop shipping and how what kind of help you do for him I watch a lot of videos about how you should do things like this so I help him and give him the information he might need he doesn't have time for doing it he's pretty busy as well because he plays football. Nice of you. If you become a millionaire, mm -hmm. what would you do with that money? I'm a big family person, so mm -hmm. I will support my family and I will show my appreciation to my parents mm -hmm. because they raised all of us. And then I will probably invest some of the money so I can make more money than mm -hmm. I have. And then I'll just enjoy myself, I guess. Yeah, Live great. life. Investing on what? Stocks, gold. Wow, you have a great mindset, actually. Yeah. What type of stocks you are interested in? Gold, mostly because the value of gold doesn't really go down and uh, maybe even like companies such as Netflix and Google and stuff like this well great and people in your age if they have no chance to do anything or they don't have any idea where to start what advice you would give to them I know people are gonna probably hate me for this go ahead but let them hate you <laughs> yeah I don't really care but I would probably recommend them watching a bit of Andrew Tate to instill that mindset mm -hmm. in them and then just get started because you're gonna regret it four months from now that you didn't get started today Mm -hmm. and it's gonna be harder it might be harder nice advice thank you very much you. enjoy your life good luck on your you. career as well you. what's good hello your name age and where are you from Ubit Maimona I'm 21 and I'm from Belgium what do you do for a living I do customer service you work in Malta yes yeah, beside your full-time job do you have any side hustle yeah I do e-commerce e-commerce yes. wow for how long you do it three years now what made you to start for e-commerce business I was just bored and searching for Mm -hmm. side hustles and I came to uh, e-commerce. Good. So is it paying your bills? Is it profitable at the moment? Yeah. Within two years, you are already profitable. Yeah. What is your product mainly? Mainly, I do uh, a bit of everything, you know. Uh, I can sell kitchen supplies, things for dogs. I do mainly uh, kitchen stuff because well, it's nice. easier to sell. In our community, we have a lot of people who want to start e-commerce business also, yeah. like online buying and selling or reselling mm -hmm. business. What advice you would give to them? How to start with that business? Because a lot of people are hearing from YouTube, like our mm -hmm. videos, that people are joining e-commerce business, but they don't know how to start, where to start. One advice that I would give is uh, to keep going keep doing your things, keep uh, putting in the work, just believing in yourself and it will be okay. But where did you start? I mean, like, you did your own research on YouTube channel or how did you do it? Yeah, I watched uh, many vi uh, YouTube videos. Mm -hmm. I bought uh, 
courses from uh, people. I try to build my own strategy. And At the moment, per month, how much is it generating for you, your e-commerce business? I don't really want to say that. It's a, bit, uh, a, a range. Give us a range. Five or six figures. You tell me. I tell you, like, per month, you make 4,000 around? Around, yeah. Uh, okay. If you become a millionaire, what would you do with that money? Invest real estate. And only in real estate you would invest? For the moment, I su suggesting real estate. Yeah. People in their early twenties, what advice you would give to them? I would tell them to work out a lot, to mm -hmm. focus on the day, to make plannings, to just be with your foot on the ground. You know, mm -hmm. just uh, and be kind to everyone. Nice advice. Thank you very much. Hello, your name, age, and where are you from? Fernanda, from Guatemala, and 25. What do you do for a living? Right now, I'm an entrepreneur. <laughs> you are an entrepreneur? Yes. Wow, well done. What we were looking for. <laughs> what business you have? Well, I'm trying to uh, to make a, like to create a tea bar in Barcelona. Uh -huh. So I want it to be like a concept of a tea bar, but not the touristic one, like the uh, the one for residents. So you okay. can go there and work there, but like have also bubble tea and these new drinks, you know. You don't like tourists? Uh, yeah, I am. I mean, I'm not from Barcelona, you know. <laughs> but it's like uh, it's already exploded for the tourists, well, but not for the residents. Today is your wedding. In November. Ah, uh, you are wearing like a bright <laughs> tint. That's why I'm asking. <laughs> what are you going to do tonight? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> What do you mean you don't know? Going to don't drink? Know. They don't tell me anything. Oh, that's a surprise for yeah, you. Yeah, everything's a surprise. Well, okay, so uh, at the moment, you are an entrepreneur. You have a business in Barcelona, yes? And how much is it generating per month? I don't know. I'm building the business. You still are still open. building, yeah? Yeah, I want oh, to open okay. in In September, what stage October. you are? Looking for the place. Okay. I have the idea, I have the. I have everything, but I need the place. How did you come up with the idea? Because um, I love tea. You love the tea, and yeah. that's why you said that I have to make a business out of it? Yeah, and I, I love uh, how people connect when they have a cup of tea together. Let's say that tomorrow you will have 1 million in your bank account. What would you do with that money? I would do like a crazy marketing campaign in Barcelona, like mm -hmm. all social media. And then I would Let's do it. Do, don't <laughs> procrastinate it. Let's do it right now. What type of marketing you have in your idea or in your brain? Let's do it. Shut it out. Okay. Uh, so I want to do like, uh, you know, like Loki cookies. Mm -hmm. I want to do that, but with the cups. I okay. want to like when you buy your drink, then you you like take some paper mm -hmm. or some sticker out and then you get your Loki face. I'm Amazing. So I like that idea. Shout out to your business name also. People in Barcelona watching to our video. Go to her tea place in the future. It's going to be called Bubble Bliss. Bubble Bliss. Yeah, in Barcelona. Amazing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, people in your age or early in their 20s, what advice you would give for them? Any personal development or financial advice? I would say just enjoy each moment and uh, cultivate nice friendship. Amazing. Well, thank you very much. Congratulations. You're going to be a vibe soon. <laughs> Your name, age, and where are you from? I'm Antonio, I'm from Italy, and uh, I'm 19. What do you do for work? Uh, nothing. I finished to study this year. Uh, so what do you want to do in the future if you don't have anything to do? I will be a student pilot in September. I will start the school. Mm -hmm. so you don't work? No, nowadays no. How do you make money? With my parents. Like uh, they give uh, me the money so I'm here to spend the, my I, parents' money. You are spending your parents' money for your friends? No, just for me. Just for you? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so it means you are spending your holiday for all covered by your parents? Yeah, we can say that, yeah. yeah. And your parents are doing a business? They have two business. What type of businesses? A bed and breakfast and uh, then uh, like a, a shop when you can buy cigarettes. I don't know how to call okay, it. Okay, kiosk. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. So in the future, what you want to do? Do you have any business idea to start? Maybe I would like to open a bar when uh, the people uh, can uh, hear some jazz. I like jazz. Oh, jazz bar. Jazz, well, yeah. nice, eh? I have one million dollar question. Okay. If you become a millionaire, if you find one million, yeah. what would you do with that money? How you would manage it? Maybe I I really like cars, so I would like to buy a car and then I will invest it. Why you want to buy a car? For yourself or investing? Yeah, no, for myself it's not an investment, I think. Mm -hmm. To buy a car is not an investment. But the rest of the part, what would you do with that money? Yeah, I will invest it like uh, in the stock. Yeah. So, what type of stock you are interested in? Uh, like safe stock. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, like the BTP in Italian are the, mm -hmm. the stock from the state. So okay. People in your age, if they are lost, they don't have anything to do, they don't have a great mindset, yeah. what advice you would give to them? Don't spend your money in uh, something that uh, is not useful for you and uh, find something that you like uh, and uh, grow it. Don't spend your money, spend your parents' money? Uh, it's an advice too. <laughs> <laughs>
Well, thank you very much. Enjoy your day. Thank you, and follow the best channel in the YouTube uh, story. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you, you heard it. Amazing. <laughs> thank you, man. Great. <laughs> Hello, your name, age, and where are you from? Sara, I'm 26 and I'm from Italy. What do you do for a living? I'm traveling and right now I'm working for EF, the language school mm -hmm. in Malta. Is it your full-time job? It's a seasonal job. Do you have a full-time job in Italy? I will have uh, in September, but not in Italy, mm -hmm. for humanitarian aid and international cooperation. NGOs. I work for NGOs. You are a homeless. <laughs> <laughs> if you wanted to put it like this, <laughs> yes. <laughs> but besides your full-time job, do you have any side hustle or do you have any side business you are running? No. no but no. do you want to start? Uh, yes, yeah, as, as soon as possible, yeah. Wow, <laughs> I just wow. got graduated, so... What stops you not for starting? My job here right now, because uh, I'm working like six days out of ten, mm -hmm. out of seven, sorry. If you become a millionaire, let's okay. say you are getting one million tomorrow, what would you do with that money? <laughs> That's an hard question. I will buy half house by the sea. Mm -hmm. For yourself? <laughs> yeah, for my family as well. Mm -hmm. And I think I will travel the world. So half of your money you will invest for property. Not investing, just buying for yourself and you, for your family. Yeah, and exactly. then the rest of them for traveling. Yeah. But you will splurge around your money for traveling. And after that, you will come back to stay in your seaside house. Yeah? Exactly. That's so, a good plan. <laughs> then how you will generate money also? Then you will start for working again? It's not all about money. It's about experiences. So as long as I have a house mm -hmm. by the sea, and I traveled like with all with the money that I got. It's Interesting, fair, but yeah. living seaside, <laughs> living seaside in a luxurious house. Okay. What experience you will get from that? I think just a place to go when I want to relax and to chill. For people in your age, what financial and personal development advice you would give to them? I'm the worst person to ask. <laughs> I just live in even the if you don't follow, but still yeah. you can give it. I would say to think. I mean, when they start university, to think about what they want to do and just go towards that goal and uh, so try to save money as much as they can and how about the personal development that wise oh personal development this is too general i would say to just search for themselves and uh, acting accordingly to their beliefs and uh, following their dreams always be nice about the financial side what is your guilty pleasure a spritz by the beach an aperitivo i'm italian <laughs> <laughs> an aperitivo by the beach yeah oh, okay every day you do it no 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 right now Oh, no, I'm not drink, drinking spritz. But when I will go back to Italy, that will be the first thing I will do. Yeah. Good. Amazing. Well, thank you very much. Enjoy your thank time. Thank you. Hello, your name, age, and where are you from? Uh, my name is Laura, 23 years old. I'm from Colombia. What do you do for a living? I am teacher with kids. W what do you teach? Uh, English. I work in one childcare. But besides your full-time job, like teaching English, do you have any side hustle? Yes, here, in this shop. Okay. And you are selling something? Yes, like coffee, smoothies. Uh, uh, you are a waitress. Exactly. Yeah. How much money you make per month? Per month like 1,500. How do you invest your money? I have to pay the rent, mm -hmm. <laughs> the food. For, for, for example, if I can go to the cinema, something like this, or go to the beach and mm -hmm. buy one beer or something like this. You drink alcohol? Sometimes. Oh, okay, <laughs> okay, well nice. So, let's say that you have a chance to get 1 million right now. What would you do with that money? Maybe travel, because I I love to travel. And traveling where? Uh, here in Europe. Italy or French mm -hmm. or Paris. Uh, my dream is Santorini. You want to splurge around all your one million for traveling, not to keep anything? No, yes, for keeping and for help my mother, my family in Colombia. Do you have any business idea to start? In this no. moment, no. Other but if you have one million, you will still not go for starting a business? Yes, it's a good option. Okay, what business? Go ahead. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe makeup, yes. So buying from oh. Colombia, selling in Malta? In Colombia, it's good watch makeup. Are you oh. sure is it makeup? No. <laughs> <laughs> you good, know what I mean. <laughs> It's a good question, but at the moment, I don't know. It's a good question. Okay, thank you very much for your great advice. I hope you will be a millionaire, and then you will splurge around all your money for traveling to Santorini. Thank you so much. Hello, your name, age, and where are you from? Roselyne, 21, and I'm from France. Giselle, 21, and I'm from France, too. What do you do for a living? I'm a student. I work in a supermarket in the, on the side, mm -hmm. but uh, I'm a student uh, on design graphic. Okay, graphic designer. So, uh, how about you? You are also a student? Yes, in uh, international law. You want to be a lawyer? 
Uh, no. But why you are studying? Uh, because I like uh, international affairs. So uh, how much you make per month from your supermarket job? Like 400. 400 per month. Is it enough for you? No, it's not enough. How you are covering up your expenses? I don't know how, but I make it enough. But you are asking money from your parents? Sometimes yes, sometimes mm -hmm. no, because I'm living uh, with my parents. You also make some money? Yes, I work on the supermarket too. I uh, make a... Uh, 800 per month. You are a manager because poor girl <laughs> makes 400 <laughs> and you make 800. <laughs> but besides your full-time job, do you have any side job? No. How about you? No, I don't have. You don't do anything? No. Because you study graphic design, yep. I suppose you have to make like freelance job. Because I'm focused on my uh, student mm -hmm. studying. But do you have a business idea to start in the future? Not really. Ah, lazy girl, yeah. come on. How about you? I don't know. If you get 1 million euro tomorrow, what would you do with that money? I will still work mm -hmm. because I like uh, graphic design. Where you will I invest your money? Houses. Ah, you will buy a house. Yeah, uh -huh. cars. How is investment? <laughs> How come? You will buy a car and rent it? I don't know, but invest in houses, yes. Mm -hmm. But for cars, I will. It was. it's just uh, for, for you. I think I will buy a house. Mm -hmm. car and give it to my family too. People in your age, what financial and personal development advice you would give to them? Make money if you want, but don't focus on work. Don't focus on money, focus on your studying. I think that if you work, you have to make uh, economy, but you also have to enjoy your life. Thank you very much. Enjoy your time. Yo guys, that's it basically from me today. I'm definitely sure you enjoyed this episode as well because you are enjoying a lot with Gen Z series. That's why I'm making it for you. Comment below which answer you liked most. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.